The number one question I get asked is, how do I get myself, my team, my business, my organisation through change effectively? The most important thing is to have the audience engaged. When they're engaged, they're going to walk away and remember the message. So if someone gave you a blank piece of paper at work and said, go for it, you'd love that. The sky's the limit. You love coming up with infinite possibilities and options. And remember, influence is a good thing. It's not manipulation, it's not negotiation. It's softly convincing, persuading for a mutual benefit between two people. It was important to me as an event organiser to bring someone who had some energy and some spark. People only buy into change if there's a benefit for them in a good way. We're the same, would you agree? Yeah, I love Renee's session. She's really able to bring the subject to life by making it very interactive. My style is dynamic, energetic and interactive. I think people really remember what they've done, not just what they've seen. So you can think of an image, draw an image and have a chat to the people in your group. Anybody else, this side of the room? Yes, thank you, down the back. Oh, you're gonna be fit. Well, you already are fit, you're gonna be fitter. <laughs> Who would open the box and just keep trying to set it up without looking at the instructions? In leadership and in any role, there's two key words, value and worth. And if you don't know the value and the worth of what you do for you, you will never have boundaries. You need to set these boundaries. What I really like is that she brings her experience from her many years of leading teams. You need to see it with your own eyes. If you can tap into what lights them up, and satisfy that, be a little bit more like them, so to speak, without changing who you are, you're gonna build rapport easily. There'll be nobody you can't get along with. I might bring up a case study or a parable or even a metaphor so they're hearing something. I might show them something and then I might give them something to read up on. After 12 years in the corporate world in senior leadership and sales roles, I've been there, I've seen the challenges we face as executives and leaders. This is what I believe the basis is of being a limitless leader. Commitment, connection and communication are your keys to move up what we call the limitless leadership ladder. She's got so much experience, she really connects with the audience and she's just very genuine. Who else is happy to share? Yes, thank you. What I love most was the way that she was able to really engage with the group, draw out the right pieces of feedback. Thanks for sharing, that's awesome. But also give us time to reflect. So often there would be the opportunity for us to talk as a group and then share some of those experiences and thoughts from the session and then that allowed us to open up at a deeper level. And then to cap it all at the end, we walk away with some really concrete and practical next steps and everyone I could see at the end of writing down the, the things that they were going to do differently as a result of listening to Renee. I'd love to work with you and make your next event one to remember.